weeks later, the emergency phase of the Oceana jet fuel spill cleanup said to be over. That word today from the Navy. Mike Gooding attended today's news conference. And Mike, what more did we learn about this? Well, David, unfortunately not the key thing, which is how did this happen and who's at fault? Today we're announcing the end of the emergency phase of the cleanup. It's been 15 days since a misplaced switch caused the spilling of 94,000 gallons of JP5 jet fuel. Most of the toxic fluid was contained on base, but at least 25,000 gallons of it got into the watershed off base. More than 700 types of wildlife, mostly fish, were killed. More than 50 families were relocated to area motels. Oceana's commanding officer today reaffirmed the Navy's commitment to the impact neighbors. As I've said before and above all else, our commitment is to the residents. We've contacted you and you've reached out to us. We're continuing to work to address your concerns and we're working to maintain and or regain your trust. The captain said the cleanup will now move into what's called the assessment and remediation phases. Far less definitive where things stand on the investigation. Are we any closer to determining how it came about that the switch was thrown the wrong way? We're not, Mike. Uh, w that investigation will continue, and uh, again, we'll get that word to you once we find out. No time limit, just you'll know when you know? We'll know when we know. Wildlife and natural resources experts this week released three rehabilitated animals affected by the spill. The Coast Guard leader from the Unified Command said team members have gone to great lengths to clean and preserve impacted natural resources. We have taken, a, I would say, very deliberate, methodical steps to ensure that we have minimized the impact to the environment. Now, the Navy said that 51 families took up the offer for relocation to area motels and that all but 20 of them have now returned to their homes. The offer is good until next Tuesday, but can be reevaluated on an as-requested basis then, according to the Navy's Captain Meadows. He said there is not a calculation yet on what this spill and cleanup has cost taxpayers. Reporting live, Mike Gooding, 13 News Now. Cleanup.